back to my channel, yeah, it's Carter, and in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys all how I got this super cute low ponytail. I did use a weave extension. Um, it's this one from Equal Hair. This is Equal Weave. It's their Amazing Deep in 18 inches. I do have it in the color number 4, which is kind of like a brownish color. And this was only $10.99 at my local beauty supply store. So basically, I'm going to be showing you guys how I do the whole process of putting it in like a little bun and then I wrap the hair extension around me so it just looks like this it's super cute I like to use it as like a protective style it helps when you don't want to do your hair for like a week this basically lasts me for a week I wore this style specifically for Valentine's Day and then I just left it in for a week and it's super cute and then I don't have to worry about doing my hair in the morning so without further ado let's get straight into this video Make sure you are subscribed to my channel, turn on your post notifications so you are aware when I post a new video, and let's just get into it. Okay guys, so I am starting out on freshly washed hair, and I'm just going ahead and spritzing my hair, because it was always starting to dry up, and then I'm taking two Goody Brand scrunchies, and my Thick and Shine gel, and I'm going to separate my hair into half, and I'm doing a side part for this hairstyle. You can do whatever type of part you want, but I like a side part. And I'm going ahead and smoothing that gel onto one side of my hair first. And I'm doing it in halves like this because my hair is so thick and it's hard to smooth my hair. So I have to separate it first in order to smooth it. So I apply the gel. Then I'm taking my board bristle brush and smoothing it out. And then I'm just going to put that section away. And then I'm just going to repeat it onto the other section. So I'm going to take the other section down and take my thick and shine gel smooth it and then brush my hair with the boar bristle brush and get it nice and smooth and also make sure you get underneath in the kitchen area so that's nice and smooth and then you should be good so now i'm going to take down that other section i had already did and i'm going to go ahead and smooth it into a low bun um, I like to try to get my bun as little as possible, so I pretty much just wrap my hair around two times, and I'm good. So after that, I'm going to use the Gorilla Snot Gel. This helps to really just hold the hair and keep it really lasting. So I really like this stuff, and I'm going to go ahead and use it to lock in that first layer of gel I did. And this really just adds like a nice sheen and hold to your hair. So I definitely recommend this gel. And then I'm just going in with my toothbrush just for those little detailed fine hairs. Just to make sure it's really smooth around my hairline. And that looks really, really sleek. And then I'm just taking any old regular holding spray. And I'm spraying it all around my hair. And that really helps to keep the style holding. Or like keep it lasting longer. So here I'm taking the hair weft and this is the double weft and I'm going ahead and I'm just, it's hard to explain. I'm basically doubling up the weft so I'm wrapping the weft, the weft around itself and then I'm going to be taking a bobby pin and sticking it through the end of the weft. You're going to see. So I'm taking that bobby pin and the end of the weft that's closed I'm going to just stick the bobby pin through it and then I'm going to add a bobby pin at the end of the weft where it's more open just so I can have more control over the style and then you see I pinned it into the bun and then I just start to wrap the hair around it's pretty simple I watched a million tutorials I couldn't personally do it my first time and then I had to realize that you really have to wrap the hair around the bun so you have to go over it and around it so that it can cover the bun I wasn't wrapping correctly the first time but now after practice I've got the hang of it so it's really really simple just wrap around the bun and as you can see it starts to cover it so yeah I'm taking another um, bobby pin and securing it to place once I'm done wrapping as you can see taking the bobby pin sticking it in and then I'm taking a piece of hair from the back and I'm going to wrap that around the weft so that you don't see the tracks of the hair so I'm just wrapping it around and then I'm going to bobby pin that into place as well it's really really simple and I love doing this hairstyle I'm taking a goody comb teasing out my hair so that it looks more fluffy and more natural and not so perfect because natural curly hair isn't perfect 
and then I'm just slicking my hair a little bit more perfecting any imperfections adding bobby pins if I need to then I'm taking my aloe berry styling gel and I'm just adding some baby hairs like so makes the hairstyle pop a little bit more and then all I have to do is tie my hair down for like 20-30 minutes and these are my final results I hope you guys all enjoy this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.